Cal Kestis was a Force-sensitive human male who became a Jedi Knight during the reign of the Galactic Empire. As one of the few Jedi who survived the purge that all but destroyed the Jedi Order, Kestis lived in seclusion on the planet Bracca for years until a confrontation with the Inquisitorius compelled him to openly resist the Empire's rule. Hunted across the galaxy by the Empire's Jedi Hunters, Kestis embraced his connection to the Force once more having decided to restore the Jedi Order. The Padawan of Jedi Master Jaro Tapel, Kestis served alongside his mentor in the Clone Wars until the Grand Army of the Republic betrayed its Jedi officers. After receiving the command to execute Order 66 from Supreme Chancellor Sheev Palpatine. As a result, the clone troopers of the 13th Battalion attempted to execute Kestis as a traitor to the Galactic Republic, forcing General Tapple to sacrifice himself in order to save his apprentice. After his master's death, Kestis lived in exile on Bracca, working as a rigger for the Scrapper Guild until he was discovered by the Second and Ninth Sisters, Inquisitors of the Empire. Kestis joined the crew of the starship, Stinger Mantis, after they rescued him from the Inquisitors. Over the course of their journey, Kestis befriended the droid BD-1, the former Jedi Seer Junda, the Mantis, Captain Grease Dritus, and the Nightsister Meron. They attempted to locate Eno Cordova's Jedi Holocron, which contained information that was vital to creating a new generation of Jedi. Though they retrieved the Holocron while surviving an encounter with the Sith Lord Darth Vader, Kestis chose to destroy the Holocron in order to protect the galaxy's Force-sensitive children from the Sith. By then, Kestis had been recognized as a fully trained Jedi by his new mentor. 